Alright guys, I wanted to do a channel update video. Um, I've had a lot of people ask me if I'm going to do a QA and a um, since my 800th video is coming up. I know it probably is like 797 or something on the videos, but I go by what the video manager says. So I still have like six more videos, I think, before 800. Um, anyways, I wasn't going to do a Q&A this time. Um, for my 800th video, I was actually going to try and get some footage of Asheville driving around, me and my brother going to the TNA Impact show um, Saturday night. So I was going to try and get some footage of that, us driving out there, showing the arena. I obviously can't get footage inside the actual show. And hopefully our thoughts leaving the show, driving back home, what we thought of it. So that's what I wanted to do for the 800th video. But if you do have any questions, um, you can leave them in the comments on this video, and I'll try to answer them as we're driving to the show. Now, I've got like three cameras ready to go for this. I've never tried to do anything like this before. I'm hoping that I can pull this off and actually edit the videos and stuff once we get back home. But I'm really just new to the whole thing, so hopefully I don't have any issues and I can get the video uploaded that night. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments, and if I get a ton of questions, I'll try to do like a mini Q&A thing or something. But I wanted to wait until um, 900 videos or something until I do another Q&A, just give myself some more time. Um, but yeah, that's what I wanted to do for the 800th video, so you can leave questions here. and. The Ring of Honor All-Star Weekend. I wanted to mention that I was going to watch this show. I went to the website, I was going to buy the show and do a review of it, and then I see that the whole show is tournament matches. And they said on TV that they were going to show every single match in the tournament on television. So why the hell would I buy this? Plus it's like $17.95. Um, I would have no problems paying for this show, but if they're going to show all the matches on TV anyway, it just seems like a waste of my money. So I'm not going to do that. Um, but anyways, there was something else I wanted to talk about here. The horror movies. <laughs> I know it's been a really long time. And what happened with the horror movies? I actually watched the first movie of the series I wanted to do next. And I took my notes and everything. This was at least two months ago, probably. Um, so I was expecting the posters to come in the mail. And I wanted to get two new posters for the series, because it's a big one. So I got one poster, and I was waiting on the second one. And then a couple weeks passed, and I'm like, okay, where the hell is my poster? So I go to the website, and I got all these off of Amazon, and I check the history, and it's not there. And I'm thinking, that's funny. <laughs> I know I bought the damn thing. So then I check the email, and sure enough, there's the order number telling me that I bought the poster. Yet on Amazon, it's like it never happened. So I send them an email, the company that made the poster, and I show them this, that I have proof I bought the poster and everything. No response at all. So now I'm just fucking pissed off. Um, so after that happened, I just kind of like forgot about it, I guess. And um, At this point, I might as well just use the poster I have, because I did get the other one on time. Um, I might as well use that poster and just do the reviews. But it really sucks because the poster I wanted to get was just so perfect. And it just it would have been great if I could have got this one. Um, maybe there's something else I can do. I don't know. But that's what took so long with the horror movies. Because I know I said at the end of the last one, I think it was the end of the last one, that I had already ordered the posters and I was just waiting on them to arrive before I uploaded the videos. But yeah, I already watched the first movie and everything. It's just that whole poster issue just really fucked me over this time. Um, so that's pretty much it. Um, I just wanted to mention that the 800th video would not be a Q&A, but you guys can still leave questions, and we should have some fun answering them on the way to the show. And I think I live like 40 minutes away from this place, so it's, it's not going to take me long at all to get there. Um, but yeah, it should be a good show, I'm hoping. Live shows are always... A lot of fun the card doesn't look too great but there's still a couple good matches on the show it's going to be Chris Saban versus Austin Aries for the title and I believe Bobby Roode versus AJ Styles so I'm looking forward to those two matches everything else 
it's like Eric Young versus Robbie E, James Storm versus Jesse Godders. So there's some stuff I don't really care to see, but it's my first TNA show. I hear the house shows are a lot better, and I'm looking forward to the experience of it all. I'm, I'm going to try and do the whole meet and greet thing where I get to meet some of the wrestlers backstage and get some pictures with them, which I'll put on the Facebook page. You can find the Facebook page in the description. Um, so that's pretty much it, guys. I just wanted to do a quick channel update here, let you know what was going on with the 800th video. And that's about it. So leave your questions in the comments below, and thanks for watching.